The Irmo Fire District has a vintage fire vehicle at their headquarters that has found its way back to the station after it was donated to help the Charleston 9 Foundation. Our street squad got a look at the very unique vehicle and here's a peek for you. It is a 1979 uh, Chevrolet with a uh, Pierce fire body on the back of it and it was donated to the Irmo Fire District in 1990. We used it for 10 years as a rescue vehicle, medical vehicle, and eventually converted into a brush truck. At its age of 25 plus years old, we no longer could use it as an emergency vehicle. We donated it to the Charleston Nine Foundation to help in any way they could sell it, do whatever they needed to. They sold it, and that was the last we had heard of it. We sold it in 2003, and then about two months ago, somebody was down in Charleston, took a picture of it, and said, hey, is this your old truck? It was, and I made contact with the owner. He had several offers, much higher than we were willing to pay, but once we told him the story behind the truck, he decided it needed to come back home. Brush Truck 17, as it was known, was here when I first got here in 1993. And so for me, it's special to get it back. And then 1998, one of the big things was we took it down to Florida, when Florida, like it seemed like the entire state was on fire. We ended up driving this thing all over a couple of counties down there for 10 days. You know, doing woods fires, brush fires. It served the community for so long. It ran so many medical calls and wrecks that, you know, there's, there's no telling how many number of houses that truck has been to. To me, it's just, it's helped out so many people in the community. And, and hopefully, again, we can get it refurbished and, and back in a condition where we can take it to fire prevention activities or use it in parades. And just find different ways that we can incorporate it back into, in, into the Irmo Fire District and, and serve the people.